how to set up this combat system to a tool. It's going to be a really si simple way. All we're going to do is reverse our disabling script. The disabling scripts make the uh, system stop working. So all we have to do is reverse that. So that when you equip the tool, the system will work. So let's get into them. So first off, I'm just going to go to starter player and start a character script and check what our system is. We can see that it's called combat and in a combat folder. Now let's go to the starter pack. We can add a tool and we can rename that combat. Very important, make sure you make sure that this requires handle is turned off. Otherwise it won't work and you'll have to put some sort of handle in it for it to activate. Next up, let's just add a local script. And this will sense when the character is equipping the tool. Now let, let's call it activate. All right, now that we've done that, we can go ahead and get the tool. Local tool, go script up here. Now we can go ahead and see tool.equip colon connect local character equals tool.parent and local character is tool.parent and now we can get a service so local players now we can get the players so players actually I don't think we need this actually yeah we can remove that um, we can get the character script from there character dot combat it's there and now we can do local and then combat dot combat right now actually gonna make put character up here and make local character and just keep it nil and then we can change remove this from local and to tool dot parent now let's do tool dot unequipped and we'll see if the character is there copy that command V and then change this to false. To test that we can go ahead and turn off the comma system so that it's disabled. Uh, actually we have to reverse these. Uh, we need to make it undisabled and disabled true. Oops. When we test the game it should we shouldn't be able to punch. See I'm clicking and nothing's happening and let's go equip the tool and now I can punch. Let's see if the unequipped is working. Yeah. There we go, we have a working tool combat system. The system is working. So if we go back into the starter pack and get go to the tool, we can go ahead and check if the character is stunned. Because the character shouldn't be able to equip the tool if they're stunned. So all we have to do is do... Actually, we can just put the all into one line. Okay. Because if it senses they're stunned, then that won't work. We also have to fix the starter player script uh, character system and make it so that it knows when the tool is being equipped. So we can put this under. But yeah, and we have to na change the name of this tool actually. I'm going to change it to fists. So that's not the same as this folder. And do the same up here. All right. So now, if we test it, it should work. We can test this out by going to over to our enemy AI and seeing if the enemy will, after the enemy attacks us. And if we put them away, we still can't punch. Even after they hit us, I still can't punch. Alright, okay, anyway, that's it for this video, guys. Thanks for watching, and fizz out.